Well, for our community and for our fans, I would like to say that Mindflex, uh, we are a very small team right now, but we are uh, uh, really diversified in a very beautiful way. For example, I am the product manager from Ethiopia. We have team members from North America. We have team members from uh, Europe, Asia, Latin America. So uh, it's a very strong and dedicated team. And for the last uh, two quarters, we have been working on the backing of the, the Mindplex platform. Uh, and then, uh, well, the Mindplex, the objective is uh, to create a decentralized media platform where you know content creation and content distribution is guided by a merit-based recommendation system. And as well, content creators and also content consumers are rewarded uh, based on a merit-based repetition engine. And all this, uh, we have been working on these aspects for the last two quarters. Uh, almost everything is finalized on the back end of these uh, features. We have now uh, a complete backing for the Mindplex magazine for the AI accessories like the repetition engine, the recommendation engine, the content factory. And as well, uh, we have been preparing on all these uh, the, the documents, the content curation documents, our white paper and everything. Uh, and then uh, I would also like to, like to highlight uh, the objective and how we want to accomplish it. As I said, the objective is, uh, you know, to create this decentralized media platform. Uh, and the problem, well, I myself is a witness. For example, I right now, I'm sending this video. I'm, I'm, I'm involved in this video from a one-tone country. And then uh, you can check how the mainstream media has uh, covered the ongoing conflict in Ethiopia. It is biased beyond your imagination. So this is what we are trying to solve. Me, my team, everyone in Mindplex, we want to give our community uh, a decentralized and a democratized media platform. And for this to happen, in addition to the technology, the, the tech side, we are going to launch uh, two tokens. One will be called the MPX token. It will be a liquid token. It can be, uh, it's a tradable token. So you can buy it, you can sell it, you can transfer it. It will be used to reward our content creators and as well, our content consumers. On the other hand, we are going to launch another token. It's called the MPXR token. It's a non-liquid token. It's a, it, you can't transfer it, you can't buy it, you can't sell it. You can only earn it. Uh, and then uh, how you are going to earn it is what I'm going to explain right now. Uh, in Mindplex, for anyone to develop a repetition, to generate a repetition, uh, you have to interact with, with content. Interaction is very simple. You can share a content, you can, com you can comment on a content, or you can like a content. So these activities, we call them interaction. And then our repetition engine, uh, it will collect all these interactions. Each of these interactions have ranges, like is it a good com comment, is it a bad comment, is it an excellent comment? And based on all these ranges, uh, they have certain values. And then you will be rewarded in a merit-based system. Uh, for uh, our plans for the coming three months, including February 2022, will be to finalize the front ends. Uh, as I have mentioned, we have finalized the back end, so the next task will be finalizing the front end. In addition to that, we will focus on refactoring our AIs. And then, of course, we will work on uh, partnership engagement, marketing, and promotion. This will be our main activities up to uh, February 2022. And then in, by mid-March 2022, we plan to launch the minimum viable product, which will include the Mindplex magazine. It will include the repetition engine. It will have the recommendation engine. It will have the content factory and perhaps the governance portal. Uh, so what we expect from our community, of course, we need your help. Uh, you can start with helping us by joining the promotion campaign. You can get involved in the surveys. You can you can share those surveys on your social media as well, so other people can see these surveys. Uh, in addition to this, you know, you can spread the good words that people are trying to, you know, decentralize media. Uh, and then uh, uh, last but not least, 
uh, I would like to say one thing. The revolution cannot be centralized. Uh, we know Mindplex is uh, heading an upward hill because it's, very, it's going to be challenging to decentralize media. But we also know that as long as we are riding with our fans, the journey will be, uh, you know, uh, good. So the outlook from our side is bright. And thank you very much for your time.